What's going on everyone? I was just recording without audio for that first game. So this video is going to be shorter than usual. But uh, yeah, wanted to get something up. So everyone know that this channel is not dead. But we're just in an awkward spot right now. Waiting for Kaladesh to come out. Um, can't really build any more decks in this week. Because I just don't have, you know, I don't really feel like it's worth to spend the money when all this new cards are about to drop on us and we're going to get all this time to brew. So, that being said, we still have quests to clear. And you can expect a ton more stuff once Kaladesh drops. I'm going to be super excited to start playing with uh, all the cool cards coming in that set. And hopefully the, the format doesn't warp itself too weirdly. If you saw the Pro Tour... You're probably aware of <coughs> how dominant a certain deck is right now. Okay, so they're going to give us an opportunity to freeboot them here. And we're going to see how good our Eldest are born. We'll draw the plant. It's going to be against this deck. Oh. I'll gladly take that back with the Eldest Reborn. Hmm. A lot of interesting answers here. I think I want to make them use... So that explains why they put their Scarab God into the graveyard. I think I want to make them use their consign here. And we're trying to destroy creatures. <coughs> so even though this may not be exactly the best play, they're pretty far from internalizing that. didn't do it. Hmm. Let's see if they do it here. Yeah. Oh no, they're not. Uh, it's pretty meaningless. Let's make it my second blue source. get blown out pretty hard here by a Liliana bringing back a Scarab God. Okay. So we Elms are born here. I think they have to sacrifice the Liliana. Oh no, they don't. Okay. That's awesome for us. Their Vraska's Contempt, I think we need to drop Vraska here. And just kind of keep time walking them. Let's see. 
think we bring back Liliana. Minus three, they're scared of God again. Solve that trigger. Plus Liliana. Play Muldrotha. Cast a land. Cast a creature. So now we're kind of overloading their turn. They can't get rid of both the Contempt and the Lily or the, the Muldrotha and the Liliana and replay their Scarab God. And we get to replay Vraska. Yep. Okay. <coughs> cool, cool, cool. That one played out pretty interestingly. That line can be really effective against Scarab God decks where you just keep bouncing it, time walking them. And as long as you can interweave plays of your own, it can be really good. I think the the turn they misplayed was when they when I played the uh when I made them sacrifice and they sacrificed their scarab god and let me take their Liliana off the board because then they just had an empty board. And if they had sacrificed the Liliana, I get, would have no attack with scarab into the scarab god. Like the freebooter can get in for one, but then on their upkeep they get to like draw four cards by bringing back their uh, champion of what says in the graveyard. For whatever reason, they just decided to put themselves into a Scarab God loop. Some kind of zombie deck. Our Eldest Reborn does not look like it'll be that good against this deck. That Scarab God, I think, will be. And Doomfall will be useful. So how is this worded? Oh, they have to have one or fewer cards in hand, too. Eh, I could have blocked there. See what's going on with their hand. Okay. So they're on like a fairly budget aggro plan here. <coughs> I think the most annoying thing, honestly, is the Chupacabra. It's going to interfere with our ability to play Scarab God. Just gonna let them get that bird down. I'm kind of okay with it. Hmm. We might get beat down here, so we don't have a lot of good plays. Yeah, I guess we go hand here. take one of these flying life linkers out. Yeah, we're in a bad spot actually. Hmm. 
Oh, what? Well, we're still at 17, but... We know they don't have an answer to Scarab Gun. However, it doesn't do a ton. A ton more than block on the ground. I guess that's just as much as Elsterborn would do this turn. lost just a budget beat down here. Yikes. Probably we needed one more turn, so blocking to let them get the cheap bone picker into play was a mistake. If we had like a chupacabra in the graveyard that we could loop back, I, mean, I guess we have draws like any removal. I think we're okay. So if we can remove, if we draw like a um, moment's craving for one of these flyers, and kill one, bring it, bring it back, it can be used to block the other. So we're just one kill spell off. But that's not it. <coughs> so now we're actually just dead on board. Unless they mistakenly... No, I mean, they can just swing with everything. But let's at least get a creature killed for our quest. And, you know, look. Let's go let them have the satisfaction of winning here. Maybe if I get a block in, it'll uh, give me a credit before the game ends, too. Mm, Doomfall disynergistic with uh, Scarab God. Oh, close. Well, anyways, I'm going to call it there. Uh, this is mostly just a quick video to get something up on the channel. And let people know, again, after Thursday, once we have Kaladesh, I'm going to be building a bunch of new decks, possibly spending a little more money to help me fill out the missing gaps, and, uh, you know, looking forward to playing a ton more Magic, just this has kind of been an off week. So, that's it for this morning. Talk to you all later. Bye.